from the shooter now to the survivors. Some told chilling stories today about being trapped in a bathroom with a terrorist. You know, people are getting hit by bullets, like blood is everywhere. And then there was a moment where he stopped um, shooting in the bathroom. And that's when everyone looked around. And that's when I first realized that my leg was shot. Our Jason Allen live in Orlando tonight with the witnesses in their own words. And Kaylee, what you see here tonight around this memorial in downtown Orlando is, is what we've seen since sunrise here this morning. People just keep coming. And some of those survivors today talked about how they don't understand they didn't end up as one of the victims being remembered at places like this. Out of nowhere, I, we just hear a big shotgun. We just, we stop what we're doing, and then it just keeps going. Then we heard additional rounds going off. So at that point, uh, my friends, my friend and I ran to the bathroom in the rear. Everybody was rushing into the bathroom stall. Everyone was rushing into the bathroom stall. Um, the gunshots were still going off rapidly, and it's still not real to me yet. I was uh, shot about three times in my leg, so I had fallen down. Um, I tried to get back up, but um, everyone started uh, running everywhere. I got trampled over. <laughs> The gunman entered the bathroom and was shooting his machine gun. So we're all like scrambling around in the bathroom, screaming at the top of our lungs. That's when I first realized that my leg was shot. There were several other people shot and bleeding in the bathroom. Um, I was hit with my foot, my left foot, um, my right knee. I could see piles of bodies laying over the toilet seat and slumped over in the bottom of the toilet was just covered with handprints and blood. I couldn't walk, so I had to drag myself out of the bathroom. I don't even know how I'm alive today. So I'm still here. One of the hospitals today said that a couple more survivors have come in in the last couple of days with injuries they didn't really initially realize that they had in the moments after the shooting. They said that that's something that could possibly continue with more people here throughout the week. Live tonight in downtown Orlando, Jason Allen, CBS 11 News.